I'm Bob Hallmark in Longview today. Let's talk lifetime wishes. Is there anything in your life that you ever wish you would have done? Well, that's what brings me uh, to Longview today and to a, a wonderful lady who decided it was time she did something she'd always want to do, wanted to do, ride a motorcycle. And here she is. This is 83 years young, Patsy Henderson. 93. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I, well, I was about to say 83, and you, you could have done that and said, okay, my apologies, 93 years young, mm -hmm. Patsy Henderson. And uh, now, tell me a little bit about this. How did this get started? I guess you said at, at one point to a friend, you know, I've always wanted to do something. What was that? Well, I was eating lunch with one of my friends here that had moved in, and I was talking to her, and she said that, motorcycles were her life. She and her husband both rode motorcycles. I said, I never rode a motorcycle in my life, but I always wanted to. Mm -hmm. And my poor son wanted one so bad and I wouldn't let him have one. <laughs> but it, it, that's the way I started and it's just wonderful. So you just, you had this urge mm -hmm. to do, now a lot of people would say at 93, do you really want to ride a motorcycle? But your answer was pretty steadfast, I guess, right? Yes, I want to do things that I never got to do as long as I can. That's so much better than sitting in a room doing nothing. And there we go. And that's uh, that's the point of what we're talking about today. Is there anything in your life as you look back at it that you wish you would have done? Patsy now does not have to wonder what if because now you've done it. I wish I could have been an actress. My mother directed the junior and senior play for mm -hmm. four to five years at Hope, Arkansas, and I grew up at play practice. Mm -hmm. And my desire was to be an actress. There's still time. <laughs> There's still time. So that's why I taught speech and drama, mm -hmm. because that's my love. Ah, my okay. daddy was wanted me to be a businesswoman. I said, Daddy, I don't like business. <laughs> I like acting and being in plays mm -hmm. and... Gotcha. So I got to do that all my life, being a teacher, teaching English and mm -hmm. speech and drama. And so I got to do the things I love for 40 years. Very good. Very good. Now we get to the actual ride itself. We're going to show you some pictures here because we've got yeah. some of uh, Miss Patsy riding. What did that feel like? You got strapped in, you got the helmet on, and then you took off. What it did it feel like? It was very relaxing to feel the wind in your face and to just sit back there and know that you had a good driver with you and riding that motorcycle and looking at all the beautiful scenery. It was so relaxing. It was so wonderful. It was everything I thought it would be. Oh, wonderful. And that's exactly the answer you wanted to have. Right. Too. Uh, there's a lot of people get the sensation when they ride a motorcycle of almost flight. It's almost like, you know, you're, you're not encumbered by you know, a canopy that's covering over you and right. things of that nature, but it, almost as if uh, you're floating across that's the ground. That's right. It was like that. If I had the money and wasn't so old, I'd buy me a motorcycle. <laughs> <laughs> you liked it that much? I liked it that much. And you not only, we're going to show you some pictures, you not only got that, but you got a beautiful jacket. Uh, you got a biker's oh, jacket yes, here. Oh, yes, they gave me this beautiful jacket and this shirt and a pin. Mm -hmm. And uh, I just appreciate and a do rag. Uh, you got a do rag. Yep. Do rag. I just appreciate everything. It was a wonderful experience for an old woman. Well, uh, <laughs> did, did, now did it catch you as a bit of a surprise when they when you were told, "Hey, we're going to make this happen for you"? Uh, yeah, I just thought somebody was coming out, and I was going to get on the back of the motorcycle and ride. So yeah. this was just out of out. oh, it was just wonderful. And it's a, a testament to, you're, you're a wonderful lady, but it's a testament to that it's never too late. Right. It's never too late. It isn't. <laughs> Congratulations, man. Thank you. All Thank right. you for interviewing me and being here. And I just love all the people that came today and all the motorcycle riders were wonderful. I knew one or two of them, so... Mm -hmm. It was good. It was it's a, it was a great day. All right. Well, I'm happy for It'll you. It'll be Patsy. a sweet memory for me always. Very good. Thank yeah. you, Patsy. Okay. All right. Now watch out. She might be on the road sometime pretty soon if she gets her own motorcycle. <laughs> we'll have more on this story tonight on KLTV Seven News for KLTV Web Extra. I'm Bob Hallmark.